Do you know anyone here called Bill? Never heard of him. Well, he works here somewhere. I know he does. And he's won this dog. Won it? Not in a pool. No, no, no. I'm from the Detective Story Weekly, a crime magazine, you know. And we ran a big contest, and the winner gets a prize of 100 pounds and this genuine pedigree man-hunting bloodhound. I see. And this bloke what you're looking for, uh, he's the winner. Uh, that's right. I've got to present it to him. And if I don't find him soon, I, I shall miss my last train home. I don't know what I'll do then, because nobody will take me in anywhere with a bloodhound. What did you say his name was? Not Dill. That's right. Hugo Dill. You do know him. Never heard of him. I may be a tough private eye, but I like my dame soft. And this baby wouldn't have splintered if you'd have hit her with the Empire State Building. She unzipped her blood red lips and said, Excuse me. Right, on stage with it, boys. Hey, no! Stop! 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 It's a golden afternoon, and the sun is a glorious yellow. And it's time for a girl and a fellow. Aren't you strong? Well, something had to be done. Oh. It's a golden afternoon. In the breeze, every party is swaying. And, and I'm, I'm sure, sure they can the hear what we're saying while, while watching from... Get out of my way around. This may kill you. But I'm trying to... Don't be... All that I see is a singing for me as it's winging its way. Is that a country? A country? Try that one over there. Go on. Full of dreams, and the girls say hello. 